Hello, Melvin. Uh, this is the solar controller, and I will introduce how to connect the cables. Uh, the right, the right three terminal uh, is for the main power supply. So uh, the main power will connect to the uh, the right three terminal. Uh, the live. The live terminal, live cable terminal, the in uh, cable terminal, and also the terminal for the earth connection. And then uh, is uh, H H1 H1 terminal. So this this two uh, this three uh, uh, terminal is for the this controller. Deliver, deliver the uh, electricity to the electric backup. So this is for the earth, uh, for the heating element. So this is the main power to controller, and uh, then the controller will deliver uh, the uh, electricity to the electric backup. Uh, this is depend on how you set the controllers. Uh, which time period and uh, which temperature you need uh, and then if you will deliver the electricity uh, to the electric backup and uh, here is uh, R1 uh, terminal this is for the pump the hot water pump uh, return the hot water uh, hot water return pipe return the water to the uh, solar tank if the temperature drop and then is T2. T2 is used to detect the uh, hot water pipe uh, temperature. Uh, there is, so uh, I have an uh, additional video uh, introduce how to set uh, uh, the, the, the temperature for the hot water return. Uh, so T2 for the pump for the hot water return pipe temperature. R1 for the uh, is, uh, this terminal is uh, deliver the electricity to the pump, water pump. And uh, here is uh, T1, T1 terminal. So uh, T1 terminal, the left terminal, T1 terminal. This is to detect the temperature in the solar water tank. So when the temperature low, then uh, like if you set 60 centigrade degree, if low than 60 centigrade degree, it will heating the water in the time period you, you set, uh, which time you want uh, the heating element begin to work. So here is the terminal for the uh, uh, controllers, uh, which you can understand. The main power uh, for the uh, heating element, deliver electricity to the heating element. This is the main power inside. And then there is R1 for the pump the power t2 detect the temperature of the hot water return pipe t1 it detect the temperature in the solar tank